What is going on guys and gals? It is your boy Jay Love coming back at you with another video about non-CDL and CDL Hotshot, about trucking in general. In this video, we're gonna be going over the month of June for one of our Lissons. As the title says, guys, one of our Lissons did make over $34,000 in the month of June. So I wanna break that down a little bit, talk about it, and kinda just you know, give my two cents and be able to help you guys out a little bit and how, how we did it, give you a couple tips, tricks, you know, the whole nine. You know, just, yeah, go over that. I don't make these videos to like flaunt the number at all. It's mostly to show you guys that that money is out there, okay? And that you guys can make that, you know, pulling loads off the load board as long as you have the right system behind you to kind of, you know, aid aid you and like, get the best loads for you. That's something that's super important. Now guys, real quick, before we get started, I want you to know of two things. First thing is we need a, a driver for our semi truck, guys. We just bought a 2017 International Pro Star. We bought a 48 foot trailer. I actually have Rod, my guy, he has his truck going to go pick up our trailer as well as some stuff that we bought from my T because it's pretty close together so that truck and trailer is going to be ready to go to be on the road in probably less than a week guys and I'm really really excited but we need a really good driver guys we are paying 25% of gross um, to this driver as well as a thousand dollars start on bonus or sign on bonus we can say that will be added to your first paycheck I'm needing a driver guys if you know somebody tell them to hit me up I'm going to put the, the google form below if that's you you know go ahead and fill that google form out we are located in Missouri I don't care if you live in Missouri but I would like you to kind of live in the Midwest I want to stay away from kind of you know East Coast or um, West Coast it's kind of in the Midwest would be great um, makes life a lot easier for all of us um, and yeah it's gonna be a great employment for somebody I mean look at the numbers we're making with this hotshot you know medium-duty hauler setup think about what we can do with uh, with a, a full-size semi truck and a 48 footer we should be doing over 30k a, a month if we're doing over 30k a month that's at least seventy five hundred dollars to the driver um and if it's the right person you know you you will get a lot of benefits to come with it but we're really just looking for the right person so if you think that's you go ahead and fill that google format and form out and i will reach out to you now second thing is guys we have spots open for our dispatching guys if you like what you see in this video the numbers that you're seeing and it's something that you know you want to be able to make with your truck hit us up guys hit, hit our dispatching up i'm gonna put my email below send me an email you know let me know what kind of setup you are let me know um you know what your expectations are what you're trying to get out of hot shot trucking in general um and then yeah new authorities are welcome too you can be a brand new authority we love working with new authorities and we think that's probably the best time to have a dispatcher is when you're a newer authority and you're kind of struggling to get um to get loads right that's when i would pay somebody our our fee is eight percent flat rate um and we we do really good work for a lot of people so i'd love to help you but back to this video guys if you don't see the loads i'm gonna put the loads up right now um usually i shout out every load and tell you the rate per mile but there were actually i think 19 loads in the month of june for my guy um that grossed him over the thirty-four thousand dollar mark um it was a great month guys um i think his total miles that he ran was ten thousand two hundred ish i'll put that up as well thank you to uh go motive or keep trucking um, for giving me this information they actually have these uh, ifta reports they call them and i'll tell you every mile you ran in each state you know for your ifta obviously but also your total miles so it's easy for us to be able to figure out your rate per mile like on all of it right because obviously the motive doesn't know if you're not loaded or loaded it doesn't matter right they just record your miles that's their job so yeah, I am in a McDonald's parking lot. No, I'm not eating McDonald's. I just had to move my car because I was shooting this video and the sun made my my make sure my phone made my phone way too hot. So I had to move and I'm trying to get some shade and whatever. And yeah, that's where we're at right now with that, guys. But yeah, if you guys want need an ELD, hit up uh, Go Motive, formerly Keep Trucking. If you do use my link, I get a little bit of cutback, and you're also gonna get a cutback. So it works out great for all of us. But yeah, back to what we're talking about, guys. Um, the the setup that made this amount of money was a f550 with a sleeper pulling a 40 foot gooseneck with with air ride i want to make that extremely clear all of these loads were pulled off of the load boards guys i think maybe one out of these 19 loads might have been a broker calling us you know saying they had this load and it worked out for us i get brokers calling me all the time but the loads never really work out for us uh, but those loads are pulled off of uh, truckstop.com. That's the only load board we use. It works really good for us. Um, we were able to make this amount of money, guys. This is not oil field hotshot, and there are no direct customers, you know, being used, being used with these loads, guys. I want you to know that. I get a lot of flack sometimes. People are like, oh, oil field, I'm doing this, or I got direct customers. Like, it's a lot different game. This is OCR hotshot. We use the load boards just like a semi truck would. This is what we got. Okay, so I want that to be clear as well. Um, the setup can haul about 21,000 pounds. This isn't a non-CDL setup. This isn't maybe even your typical hotshot setup that can haul 17,000 pounds. This is a, you know, an F550 
with a 40 foot trailer that can do 21,000 pounds guys. So some of these loads were probably 19,000, 20,000 pounds. Um, and just having the avail the, the biggest part of this guys is having the ability to take any freight that's on that load board, right? Let's say if you get stuck in like a kind of a scarier spot or like a scarcer spot, you can say, you know, being able to have air ride, being able to haul a little bit heavier, being able to do those things, is gonna help you get out of that area to go to the next area, right? You don't wanna get stuck in a place and just cause you can only haul 15,000 pounds um, and you don't have tarps, you can't find any loads, guys. So it's really important you know, to have tarps with you guys to, to have everything you need um, to be able to haul the loads that are popping up. Because like I said, I've said many times, hotshot trucking is a small piece of the pie, okay? You got flatbed, flatbed trucking right here and the hotshot's an even smaller piece, okay? So you wanna be able to haul any load that falls in the realm of that hotshot piece, right? And so, you know, that's what the kind of setup you need to have. People ask me all the time about setups and I'm like, guys, just be able to haul as much as you can. Right, so get the biggest truck possible, biggest trailer possible, have tarps, have chains, have binders, you're gonna be okay, right? And then build a system around it. Um, you know, he uses one of our um, one of our dispatchers, so he has he has a dispatcher, he's not self-dispatching guys. Some people do self-dispatching, it works out for him, some people it doesn't. If you're a newer authority, I would say hire a dispatcher when you're starting out, you know, let them help you get set up with these brokers, let them help you find loads, and then once they kind of build you, you know, build you um, up and get you set up with all these brokers you can kind of start doing it more on your own if you're trying to take a step back but if you're really really focused on making money when you first start i think it's important to have somebody in your corner that has experience to help you get these loads um, it can be really difficult if you don't i mean it's difficult for us when we first started now almost two years um, in it's, it's it's a lot different guys um, but those are some kind of important points when it comes to this guys um, he had a dispatcher Obviously we have, we have tarps, we, we can do air ride, we have ramps, you know, we have all these things, we can haul 22,000 pounds. All of that comes into play when we're talking these bigger numbers. Now, let's talk about the rate per mile. The, the average rate per mile, guys, on all miles was $3.36 per, per mile, guys. To me, that's an awesome rate per mile, especially for a medium duty or a hot shot. I mean, if it gets higher, it gets higher. Let's fetch and go, you know what I'm saying? But um right now the way i'm looking at the market the way i'm looking at everything is we as as the drivers right now or as the trucks we have we have power right now guys you know fuel's really expensive um and a lot of these smaller um these smaller companies that might have been hauling they're kind of you know might be taking a step back no offense to non-cdl guys but a lot of non-cdl guys aren't affording to pay their bills so they're kind of taking a step back and it leaves it open to us when we're talking to broker to say hey we know we're lacking a little bit of trucks right now fuel's really high let's get this price up you know what i'm saying i would say three three dollars and 36 per month cents per mile with how fuel is right now is probably roughly about 280 or 290 with how fuel was back in the day right so we're talking about a year ago or whatever before we had this huge spike in fuel so still a really good rate per mile and we're still profiting really good money guys like i said people ask me well how's the fuel affecting you i'm like well the fuel only affects us if the rates aren't where we need them to be but if we're averaging three dollars and 36 per cents per mile the fuel doesn't really affect us now if fuel goes down and we keep that rate per mile up perfect profits are going up guys but as fuel increases obviously our rate per mile has to increase which is going to hurt the consumer the customer but it is what it is and i think a lot of times guys we don't really know how much money these brokers are getting for these loads and a lot of times these brokers are making a pretty penny so i think really the person that's affecting the most hopefully are the brokers and that's what that's what i'm hoping for so those greedy most of those greedy a -holes, some of them are good people but they can just chill to flip out right so yeah guys did 34,450 I think I have I think it's on there you'll see right now in the month of June guys crazy 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 month truck held up great um, it was really a really good month for him to come back and be able to put up those numbers um, like I said guys this is this is no cap I have all the info about it I can show everyone's like oh yeah I don't you can't do that blah 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 where are the rate cons I was like boys if I wanted to, to take all the time to blur out everything I need to on each rate con I'd show you um, but obviously I don't need to do that you guys can just trust me at this point but I'll show you the loads any day of the week um, it's, it's been a blessing guys you know if you get out there and you really focus on you focus on your system you focus on getting the job done correctly 
Um, profits are gonna come, guys. Profits are going to come. Like I said, we have openings for our dispatching, guys. We have openings. The same dispatchers that dispatch this truck right now can be your dispatchers as well. We get them in your corner, we get them making money. Some people say, oh, I had a couple guys, one guy in particular, the dispatching didn't work out for him. And I couldn't remember who it was, but now I do. And it was just a funny scenario because he hauled a load that after the fact, his factoring company kept denying all these brokers. Like they wouldn't really factor anybody at a trash factoring company. He hauls a load and then he's just like stressed out about getting paid for that load. So he doesn't want to move. And then he's like sending loads to my dispatcher. He's calling me saying how he can't pay his bill. I mean, just a whole ton of stuff was happening. And I'm like, of course, man. Like, but obviously we're the problem as a dispatching company, right? Obviously every single time people want to point the finger. Anyways, regardless, doesn't matter. What matters is guys, I know how our system works. I know how good it is. These are the results of the system. If you guys need a dispatcher, hit me up, my email down below. Um, shout out to our Lissons, awesome guys, making good money, they're all awesome. Well, some of them are vacation right now, some of them are still on the road, but we're out there killing it, guys. I need a driver for the, the for the semi truck. If you would like a driving job, maybe you're an owner operator right now and you want kind of more of a secure, um, a secure uh, position and a full-size truck or you want to get, you know, more experience with a full-size truck, hit me up guys. You know, I'd love, you know, like I said, we're going to be doing over $30,000 a month. I think every single month without a doubt in this truck, as long as that truck's on the road. Um, and that's a good paycheck for you. You know, I don't know why the driver can't be making $10,000 a month, you know, in this gig. So guys, let's get it going. If you guys need anything, hit me up. All my stuff's down below. Like I said, if you guys need a factory or a fuel car, I'm going to put my link down below as well. Uh, my guy Kenneth is awesome. Just fill out your info, click that link, fill out your info. You'll get a phone call. They'll get you going there, but love you guys so much. Hope you all have a great day and we'll talk later.